A few weeks ago, we did an experiment using wood for a resin mold. There were some mistakes. But in this video, we're gonna see if we can fix some of those mistakes. So let's do it. This experiment started out pretty much like the last one. A piece of hardboard for the back of the mold and a two piece mold for the sides made out of three quarter inch plywood. This time we decided to make a heart. The new idea for this attempt was to use wax paper on the backing board to prevent some of the problems we had with pitting that was caused by the petroleum jelly last time. This was just wrapped around the board and taped off. We still used the petroleum jelly on the sides to prevent the resin from seeping through into the plywood. This works great, but does leave a little bit of a rough edge. Possibly something we'll address in a future experiment to see if we can figure a way to cast the sides without the jelly. Once the sides were coated and the wax paper was in place, it's just a matter of clamping each of the two halves to the backing board. Then you can mix, pour, and prep the resin for curing like you normally would. Unmolding the heart was relatively easy. It doesn't pop out quite as well as it would from a silicone mold, but still decently. As you can see right away, the wax paper both worked and it didn't work. It did allow us to remove the heart with some ease, but some of it remained on the heart as well. So to make some lemonade out of this lemon, we scrubbed off what had stuck with a scratch pad and some soapy water. It did remove the paper that had stuck, but left a little bit to be desired as far as clarity goes. So to fix this, we brushed on a thin coat of resin. For now, I think we'll call this experiment a success in the making. We learned a few things along the way and got some ideas for a future go at it. So if you have any suggestions on what we could do differently, let us know in the comments below. This is something we plan to keep working on until we get it all figured out. So thanks for watching, don't forget to like the video if it was helpful, and if it's your first time here, check out the rest of our videos and maybe consider subscribing. We tackle fun and creative projects like this one every week. As always, until the next video, be safe and stay creative.